are taking up the sport of wrestling. ABC's Rena Roy introduces us to Columbia University's Women's Wrestling Club in New York City, where the team is taking the school by storm. More women across the country are putting on their singlets and snapping on their headgear to take to the wrestling mats. Don't give space, take space. At Columbia University, the men's team dates back to 1903. It took more than a century for the women's wrestling club to form. First person, one, two. But in just a few years, they're rising through the ranks. To have us here is a huge start. Our first ever women's practice here at Columbia University was in April of 2015. And so it's almost a decade later, and here we are with 30 women. Women's collegiate wrestling is considered an emerging sport by the NCAA, on track to have its first NCAA championship by 2026. And although Columbia's team does not have varsity status, the overall growth of the sport is opening up opportunities opportunities for their athletes. <coughs> Columbia's captain, Maya Latona, recalls wrestling against boys in high school. I think if anything, the guys were a little shocked to see me there and see me scrap. Now on a team of all women, her talent has flourished. She even recently competed in the Olympic trials. I'm incredibly fortunate to be in the position that I'm in. I think Columbia has um, done a great deal for me in my athletic career. Uh, the club team has been a great blessing in my life. Latona and her teammates are competing and winning against varsity programs as a club team themselves. But despite the success, club funding is limited. Each wrestler chips in to help fundraise for their own equipment and events. Our varsity sports have a coaching staff of three to four people on every sport. Uh, I'm a staff of one. We have to fundraise our own cash. We need to advocate for ourselves. The team hoping to break barriers and hoping for more inclusivity in the sport. I hope that if women out there seek the opportunity to wrestle, that it's available to them. If they would like to find a safe space for them to express themselves uh, through athletics, I hope that wrestling can serve that. Rena Roy, ABC News, New York. And closer to home, the University of Iowa added women's NCAA college wrestling as an intercollegiate program in 2021. This year, they won the national championship, and their coach was named one of USA Today's Women of the Year.